Welcome to today's encouragement from Our Daily Bread. Our reading titled, Strong and Good, was written by Patricia Rabin. The young campus minister was troubled, but he looked conflicted when I dared to ask if he prays for God's direction, for his help. To pray as Paul urged, without ceasing. In reply, the young man confessed, I'm not sure I believe anymore in prayer. He frowned, or believed that God is listening. Just look at the world. That young leader was building a ministry in his own strength, and sadly, he was failing. Why? He was rejecting God. Jesus, as the cornerstone of the church, has always been rejected, starting, in fact, with his own people. Many still reject him today, struggling to build their lives, work, even churches on lesser foundations, their own schemes, dreams, and other unreliable ground. Yet, our good Savior alone is our strength and defense. Indeed, the stone the builders rejected has become the cornerstone. Set at the vital corner of our lives, He provides the only right alignment for anything His believers seek to accomplish for Him. To Him, therefore, we pray, Lord, save us. Lord, grant us success. The result, blessed is He who comes in the name of the Lord. May we give thanks to Him because He's strong and good. Today's Our Daily Bread devotional scripture reading is from Psalm 118, verses 13 through 14, and verses 22 through 29. I was pushed back and about to fall, but the Lord helped me. The Lord is my strength and my defense. He has become my salvation. Now picking up at verse 22. The stone the builders rejected has become the cornerstone. The Lord has done this, and it is marvelous in our eyes. The Lord has done it this very day. Let us rejoice today and be glad. Lord, save us. Lord, grant us success. Blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord. From the house of the Lord, we bless you. The Lord is God, and he has made his light shine on us. With bows in hand, join in the festal procession, up to the horns of the altar. You are my God, and I will praise you. You are my God, and I will exalt you. Give thanks to the Lord, for he is good. His love endures forever. Let's pray. We praise you, Jesus, for being the chief cornerstone. Only on you can your church and our lives stand. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Thanks for listening today. My name is Joyce Dinkins, and today's encouragement was provided by Our Daily Bread Ministries.